Welcome. I am Icarus. This is Buck. We are here with Inigo, the kitten, cat, whatever you want to call him, that backstabbed us. Uh, but we've reunited. They've made up. And uh, we're going to go about our way. Uh, I'm going to take Inigo's journal. Okay. Uh, we will read this later. And uh, I don't know if we need to take his dragonfly. All right, bird. Uh, Inigo the Brave. I guess we'll take that too. Uh, storage chest. I guess this is some of his weapons and armors. But we have been re reunited. Um, obviously, Buck didn't kill him. So that's that's positive. That's good. So let's mm -hmm. talk to our friend. Uh, any the thoughts? The guards here are all blind, deaf fools. Don't worry, they didn't hear me say that. All right, that's a uh, good, good, uh, some good thoughts. Uh, so Inigo has given us some information on a um, group of Khajiits that need our help. Um, they've been um their their caravans are being constantly raided by bandits and so we're gonna help them um let's eat a little bit we're gonna go check that out maybe do a little bit of fishing before uh before we leave you know what in fact why not let's Dip our pole in the water a little bit. See what we can get. I'm really excited to get Inigo as a father. A f father. Follower. Um, I've. I normally don't use followers. To be perfectly honest. So. I'm really big on using summons and stuff. For most of my characters. So this is really. Going to be new for me. Um. If you'd like to put in comments as advice on how to use Inigo, let me know. Oh, buddy, we don't need that. Look, at he's got a rifle just like me. I really like his little top hat. So we're, we're a couple of... We're not scoundrels. We're like uh, cowboys gallivanting through uh, Skyrim. All right, we'll uh, we'll take it. Inigo, where did you go? Where did he go? Hmm. I'm not sure where Inigo went. He is gone, like gone, gone. Guess he got bored when I was uh, fishing. Oh, there you are. Okay, so maybe I'll I'll cook you that fish. You can have it. All right. So this is gonna make things a lot easier having Inigo as a tank. Uh, we're gonna ignore her. I feel like Buck would do that. Um. He's he's he helps people, but he's not you know a, a good good doer doer. If he sees someone in need, he doesn't necessarily feel like he needs to help them. All right. So here's also here's something I need to consider. Oh. Don't careful. Ooh, did I? Careful. Dude, you're just like running out into the woods. This isn't going to be good for you. Got him. Oh, and that is a... Two trolls? Alright. Well, this is what we do. We are monster... Hunters, uh, Inigo. 
We've got to be careful. Alright, I need to save. I just don't want to wing that dude. Come on. Watch out. And there go. See those guys right there? Those giant trolls? This is like they're where you want to, I don't know, kill them. Okay, I need my... There we go. Ooh. There we go. Gotcha. Awesome. So this is great news for us. We've gotten to... Thank you, Inigo. That was great help. Don't know if we could have done that without you. So we're going to take the blood. We're going to take the skin. And we're going to take the ingredients. So I think we're going to visit the apothecary later. Um, should we take the meat? Yeah, why not? Maybe we can cook something up. I'm sure Inigo would like that. Um, take some water. We do need to buy some salt. So where is that other... Where is he? Is that right? There he is? Yep. Okay. So we'll take your blood. Skin your pelt. Here's something I need to do. Uh, audio. Music. There we go. And we will harvest your ingredients. Um, I think we're going to spend the night here. No reason to go into town. Um, we'll have to big, build a bigger tent so that both of us can sleep here. But for now, my dude, you're like right in the way of the. Come on, come on, come on. Can you? My friend. Oh. Skyrim is a big and often confusing place. We are bound to lose each other from time to time. Never fear. That map you have is special. This old thing? How so? I know. Keep your filthy mitts off it. Uh, this old thing. Yes. Uh, there is more to it than you may realize. My brother once found one just like it on the remains of some poor old adventurer in Citadel. It does not only mark locations. It can also show the position of items and people too. Watch this. Where are you, Inigo? There. Oh, this is interesting. See, Ooh. I have placed myself on your map. If we find ourselves separated, oh, that's awesome. All you need to do is look me up. Pretty fantastic, eh? Inigo, I do appreciate this. Thank you. Quit showing off. It's great, Inigo. Thank you. I don't try. Okay, yeah. No problem. I am always happy to help. Um, I'm really liking set. what Inigo is, is bringing to Buck's story. Uh, I need you to do what something. Have me do? Why don't you stand right here? I'll make you some dinner. Do you want something or not? I am no, just wait right there. Uh, let me look at something really quick. So, sun, helm, general settings. Um, I might need to look at this off camera if I can't just figure it out right off the bit, bat, but I wonder if this need system works for um, followers as well. It looks like maybe not. That's okay. Oh, he's got fleas. It's 
okay. He's been in that disgusting Riften jail for a little bit. Um, which, by the way, uh, Buck doesn't really have a huge, uh, high opinion on Riften. Just in whatever, what little time he spent there. Um, kind of fits, though, what he's used to. Reminds him of those little towns that he'd visit. Pick up little contracts to hunt monsters. So me and Indigo are going to hang out tonight. We'll make some food. Buck will make, make him some food. We'll uh, catch up on uh, what we've missed. And then I think there is a festival coming today tomorrow happy birthday that's nothing where we need to sell that um, I thought that there was a festival I think there is okay let's get a roaring fire going all right let's eat a little bit and uh, we're gonna pull out our ingredients And uh, our food, we'll take some of that charred meat, saber cat meat, a bottle of water. Okay, let's see what we can make. I think we'll go into town and buy some salt. Um, we definitely need to do that to cook a lot of different things. Ooh, Vir virulent poison damages the target's health by 50 points. Yes. Oh, we can make a couple of them. Okay. We need to start making these beast oils and stuff, too. Um, okay. Can't really make much. We'll throw a lot of the raw goods on the horse for later. And we'll throw that slaughter fish on. And, uh, yeah. Um, buck and Inigo have a meal together. They make up, they're good. They're solid. Inigo explains why he did what he did. Um, and Buck in the end understands, you know, he was trying to survive, it wasn't personal. And he sees that Inigo feels guilty, horrifyingly guilty, guilty enough to throw himself in jail. Um, oh well. Wow. All right, let's see if we can get any perks in our archery tree. This is the one I want the most. That'll help us a lot. Um, bashing with a bow or crossbow staggers the target. Bows and crossbows deal 20% more damage. Yeah, sure. And... I'll take that. Should have took an alchemy one, but it is what it is. We'll have a stew, bear carrot stew, delicious. Some water. Won't tear down our tent yet. Good morning, Indigo. Ooh, it's a beautiful, beautiful day. Let's check the weather. It's nice and warm. Let's take off our, not our backpack. There we go. All right, and then we don't need our lantern. I was wondering, can you whistle? Can I whistle? Well, it could be a good way for us to quickly communicate. Look, okay. I found this book. It made interesting reading. Maybe you should give it a look. Over. Anyway, what did you want to talk about? Uh, any thoughts? I see you found Inigo the Brave. It's just a little thing I've been working on. It is probably rubbish. Hand it over, and if we're relaxing somewhere safe, I'll read it to you if you want. Oh, wow, he'll read it to me? Okay. You lead, I follow. All right, Inigo, well, you're going to follow me. Let's see if we picked up any skills. And uh, we will go into town. And uh, we're going to be looking for a Kaji caravan. But until then, let's see if, yeah, we got some skills. 
cycle of life. You can now bury your fallen friends or foes. Alternately, you can also harvest the corpse of a humanoid, ra humanoid race at the cost of it. No, don't want that. You learn to safely deactivate bear traps. Um, I don't really want any of those. I'm afraid one of those perks is going to interfere with another mod I have. Okay, so great. We'll take that. That's going to give us, I think, better stamina regeneration. Looks like it's going to rain. I hope not. Um, your horse are your horses are well trained, allowing them to sprint for longer. Yes. All right, we're getting better at cooking, but no perks. Okay, buy salt, buy salt, buy salt. Let's pack up. In I go. You want to ask me something? I don't. I want to head into town and buy some salt, make some alchemy potions. What time is it? Yeah, let's uh, see what we can get off this wolf. We can improve Inigo's um, armor a little bit too in his gun. I think we're good on our end. Okay, get over here. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Let's see here. Ah, looks like that's it. Okay. Go. So we got a letter from the Jarl about if you need um, else, just ask. us having some type of renown. I have to try so hard not to save. I'll break myself of that. I've, that's called trauma from, uh, I save a ton and it's trauma from crashes. So, but I know it's annoying and I'm going to try not to. Um, do, I've been thinking about what has happened to Buck and, uh, I heard that Hawk call out to us, but whatever. Um. So what happened to Buck on the ranch, in more detail, is uh, a rancher's son died. Uh, they were trying to conjure some otherworldly entity. The person that caused this, the the the, the persons I who had the idea to do this originally, was uh, Buck's brother. Buck. Buck's brother uh, dabbles with magic. He's always done that. He's always been small, uh, and he was bullied when he was younger. And he's sought out other other ways of gaining power. Um, and so this just particular time uh, was met with disaster. Um, basically, he angered. Uh, what appeared to be a god of madness and um, in doing so it killed the rancher's son so I am not I would like to use your alchemy lab though sir good sir all right that's awesome well thank you well, we're gonna experiment a little bit see what we can come up with all right I do love alchemy a lot. I have a question for you guys. It seems like Ravage Health is pretty pointless. Um, from what I've understood, concentrated poison temporarily reduces maximum and current health by 11 points for 10 seconds. So it seems like lingering health has is a way better, um, way better. But correct me if I'm wrong. I've just Ravage health doesn't sound very good. This is also another way for us to make some money. Um, so this is this is what um, Buck does: collects his ingredients and then repurposes them then for uh, poisons to help him with his hunts to get better, better, better 
hunting gear drains the target's health by six points per second for 10 seconds damages the targets yes that's great it's gonna help us tremendously okay so we got a lot now we can sell don't have a lot of money but that's okay this place has seen better days but it's not my fault so you're interested in my okay, so it and seems like she's squabbling a little bit with uh her husband but that's okay or someone that lives here so we're gonna sell a lot of these bones i don't think we're gonna do anything with them we're gonna keep all the poisons we'll sell these don't need the magic ones we're never going to use magic don't want anything don't ever want to be around magic don't need all this fat well we can use that for fires okay so we just ate all that disgusting alchemy stuff so do we have any alcohol no unfortunately not but i would feel like in my mind, after eating all the, trying all those ingredients and experimenting, we'd want some alcohol. But alas, we do not have any. So, we're just going to have to accept it. Um, let's see if the Kaji have come here. Let's see if we can pick up a contract from them. We might just kind of stay in town for today. Uh, hang out at the festival. Nope. No Kaji. Alright, so we'll do a little bit of hunting. Then head back into town and, s and we'll spend the night. Why not? Uh, whoa, you're not going to kill me, are you? Are you? Uh, Inigo has been living in a, uh, in that dungeon for I don't know how long. He's put himself in a purgatory. Hello? What? What is that? What was that? Oh, it was an Otronaut. Did you guys see that? Ooh, you look great with that. Oh, that's so good. Look. Oh, that is so cool. You've contracted Bonebreaker Fever. I don't know. From what? Um, well, we'll have to cure that. It's fine. That's what we get. For being outdoors. We're used to that. Alright. That's what you get, miss. For trifling around with the... Such things as Daedra. 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 That's how a buck would say it. Daedra. No, it doesn't say the Daedra part. Daedra. Right, not, don't leave this to waste. Oh, there's an arrow in there. So someone... Someone was hunting this. Killed it, but didn't... Take the meat. Or any of the ingredients. Strange. We'll take advantage of this. All right. So let's keep hunting. Hunting. Let's get some some jerky meat. That charred meat. It's disgusting, but uh, we need to get it out of our inventory. Ooh. Watch out. Woo! Come on. Got him. Hunting skill increased to five. Awesome. So we just got a bear. We love bear meat. That's what we make our carrot stew out of. It appears that there are still some animals around. There's another bear. It's a cave bear. It's kind of sad it's a cub, but it is what it is. Uh, Inigo. Behind you. Oh! Oh! Ouch! It's 
sorry for yelling at the microphone. Okay, this is great. Just got a ton of ingredients. We'll skin what we can. We're not going to do it all, but do some of it. Ooh, excuse me. Get the meat. And uh, harvest the ingredients. That was intense. That could have gone horribly. We could have died. And if we died, that was the end of Buck's story. Uh, this is a permadeath series. And if we die, we die. No, we, this isn't really a permadeath series. But I do not like to die. So. Might as well collect all this stuff we can tan the leather indigo really had our backs back there we would have died um, but we were uh, we work together we make a good team that's why we work together in the past okay let's clear that any more one more. Let's be careful. Alright, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to hotkey all of this. And we're going to start using our poisons. They're there. No reason not to. We'll uh, have a drink at the tavern after this. Hang out. Spend the night. Share stories. Catch up with Inigo and uh, maybe if that festival starts off we'll head out and do a little partying hopefully I thought the the flyer said it was coming out on the 24th oh. what was that back to what mm -hmm. any thoughts I'm thinking you look ill yeah if you need anything else just ask we don't feel great. Okay, let's get back to the alchemist. Yeah. And we'll, uh, there we go. We'll buy a cure disease potion. I wish we could make one. They're probably super expensive. In fact, I don't even know if we'll have enough money to stay the night. Um,. And in the morning, hopefully that Kaji caravan will be on its way. It's such a beautiful town. It might be a little seedy. Ooh, it is going to rain. Alright, alright. I'm taking care of it, miss. I'm kind of busy, but if you need any potions, you're here for Take a look. Sir, I need to buy a cure disease po potion. Oh, oh my gosh, they're expensive. So we don't have enough money for it. Um, hmm. What to do? Okay, we'll be back. We're going to go to the pawnbroker, or whatever he's called, a trader. I thought that was a vampire. What do you call yourself? Pond Prawn. Great, great name. Okay. So let's see. Do we have anything to sell? I'm sure we do. Um. Gains 15 soul energy when a living foe dies. Yuck. Yeah, that's something that um, he doesn't want to keep in his inventory. Did I say yuck as a player? I did. I said yuck. I was disgusted. Anything else? Okay, well, we at least have enough money. To buy a cure disease potion. We won't have enough money though. 
to stay the night here, but that's not a problem for us. We are avid campers, so we'll just stay the night outside. All right, let's skin all this. Wow, we have a lot of leather. We'll level up. Try to do this as quickly as I can. And then we'll sell it. This is great. We're getting good levels in smithing. Oh no. I don't think I was I was supposed to save the wolf pelts. Okay, that's fine. We'll get more wolf pelts. Come to see Balaman. Looking to protect the future. Or deal some damage. Um. All right, let's sell that. Let's sell that. Good. We got some good coin. Maybe we can buy some drink. Head on down. <laughs> uh. Buck, that uh, staff's not gonna keep you dry. But uh, good for you. Let's just say he's covering his head with his sleeve of his coat. Not a fan of the rain. I'm kind of busy, but if you need any potions, yeah, I do. So, you're interested in my potions and man, you're really breaking the bank with that. Okay. Oh, I could have used some of this. Yes, I know this is a little cheat cheating, but I want to show you guys something. So Buck was able to make this uh, perfume, and it's incredibly intoxicating to those who smell it. There you go, Buck. So now, so you're an alchemist then. Let's see. Yep, it's a hundred dollars cheaper. Almost by another one. Yes, yes. Alright, we're going to drink that right away. Though we need to start keeping a couple cure diseases on us at all times. Um, we have a resistance to, cure, to disease, I thought, as a... Um, as a wood elf. I thought the game crashed for a second. Okay. What time is it? Any partying? Do we got it going on? I, I bet you anything. Just be patient. So we'll spend an hour here. If you've got the coin. And then, uh, we'll just hang out at the bar a little bit for an hour. And then we'll head out, hopefully. No, I was wrong. No festivities. Well, that's disappointing. That's okay, though. All right, well, I thank you guys for watching. We'll see if we can contact the Khajiit. Who are being hassled by the bandits and uh, I thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next episode.